So one of the powerful things that really takes NetLogo to the next level in terms of the advanced uh, capabilities it has, um, and this is true of a lot of agent-based modeling platforms, is the ability to bring in outside uh, commands, right? Outside software to interact with the NetLogo program and environment. And in NetLogo, that's done through two APIs, which we'll talk about, right? The first is the extensions API. The extensions API in NetLogo logo gives you the ability to create new commands for the NetLogo's language, right? So you can, and these commands could be driven by external software you have, or they could just be new commands you want to add to the, to the language itself. And often this is done to give NetLogo access to those external software packages. And I'm going to talk about two of those examples today, the GIS uh, analysis tools and the network analysis tools that are built in as extensions to the NetLogo software. Now, besides the extensions API, there's also the controlling API and the mathematical link, which are closely related, right? NetLogo can't be invoked by another program if that program is capable of running on the Java virtual machine. This means you can call NetLogo code directly from a bunch of other languages like Java, Scala, Clojure, Groovy, JRuby, um, uh, Jython, and several others. The Mathematica link operates similarly in that it allows you to call NetLogo code uh, from inside Mathematica. Uh, I'm not going to go into too much detail about those particular, about the Mathematica link or the controlling API, but if it's something you're interested in, I highly recommend looking at the user documentation that's available on the NetLogo website about that.